Hello, how are you today? Hi, hi. <clears throat> I'm fine. Excellent. Great to hear that. Vamos a ver. Checking, checking. Okay, let's go to the attendance. Monday, right? Monday, Monday. Okay, let's see. Angel, 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 no here, Angel. No? Are you students? Present. Okay. Guadalupe? Present. Yes. Edwin? No here? Fatima Sumara. Present teacher. Great. Isabel. Present teacher. Luis Mauricio. Present teacher. Maria Martins. Maria. Present teacher. Maricel. Present teacher. Marlene. Marlene. No here, Marlene. Maura. Maura, Maura, no. Nidia. Nidia. Oscar. Ricardo. Present teacher. Okay. Teresa. Teresa. Present teacher. Good night. Buenas noches. Hello, Teresa. Walter. Walter. No here. Tengo un montón de paz. Yo veo 14 acá. Judy. Present teacher. Yesenia. Yesenia. Walter. Oscar. Oscar. Nidia. Present, present teacher. Okay, Oscar. Nidia, Nidia, Maura, Marlene, present teacher, Edwin, Angel, present teacher. I see, I see a lot of people here, but I, I got a lot of spaces without saying present. I should have only four. Who didn't tell me present?
Denia. Hello, teacher. Present. Ya estoy aquí. Ok, Maura. Teacher. Ah, you didn't tell me present. And yes. Yeah. Ah, no, Nidia is the one who didn't tell me present. Ok. Mm -hmm. Maura, present. Okay. Okay, I count the spaces with the people. See, if I have so many people, why I have so many spaces, right? Well, how are you? How are you? Fine. Fine, fine, nice, nice. Well, let me share the presentation. We are going to make a mini review of of the last two previous classes, right? Because of the weekend and because we may forget something on the weekend, right? A ver. Sure. Last, last class, remember, we were talking about the present simple. Do you remember? Thursday, we were talking about present simple. And on Friday, too, well, on Friday, we were talking about the present simple versus present continuous, right? Okay, tell me, when do we use the present simple? When? When do we use the present simple? We use the present simple when is uh, when is a uh, uh, generally or or always always thing we we do. Uh huh. Exactly. So when we talk about something that is always true, right? Uh, that means something that I cannot change. That's why we're talking about facts, right? A fact. A fact is something that I cannot change. I cannot change. It is always the same. It will always be that way. For example, if I say water boils at 100 degrees, can I make water boil at 20 degrees? Definitely. Mm -hmm. Yes. Water boils at 100 degrees. That is a fact. I cannot make water boil at less than 100 degrees, right? It rains a lot in Lithuania. Does it rain a lot in El Salvador? No, right? Not a lot. But there are some places in the world, there are some places where it rains all the time. Then you can say it always rains a lot. Okay, the sky is blue. Is that a fact? What do you think? The sky is blue. Mm -hmm. The sky is blue. Can you see the sky in a different color? Yes or no? Are you there, chicos? Siento que me contesto yo sola. Y no me gusta. Ya lo saben. A ver. Uh -huh. Yes, the sky is blue. Okay. Always. No, vea, no always. No. But, no. Uh -huh. but it's, and that's why we have this word general. This generally. Generally true. Generally means like most of the time, but from time to time it may change. Okay, for situations that are more or less, okay, permanent. Mm -hmm. 
for situations that are more or less permanent. So you say, I live in New York. I live in El Salvador, right? I live in San Salvador. I live in Sonsonate. I live in Aguachapán. These are situations that are, when we say more or less permanent, is because they may change. Okay, Teresa, desconectese y conectese de nuevo. That may help. Okay, so, so when I say something that is more or less permanent, is because it can happen now, but tomorrow it may change, right? Or in a couple of weeks, or in a month, or in a year, it may change. Yes? John works at, in the bank. At the moment, he works in the bank. So it's more or less permanent, right? Lisa studies architecture. Probably may, next semester, she will decide adding something else, right? Okay, then we also use the present simple for things we do regularly. Hobbies, habits, routines. In those cases, I'm going to use the present. So you say, every day, I get that's routine, right? I have a shower and eat breakfast. Or you can say, I take a shower and eat breakfast. Then I take the train to work. Or then I take the bus to work, or then I take a taxi to work. Or I take an Uber to work, right? Sometimes I take an Uber to work. Okay, every Thursday I play basketball. What is that? Is that a habit? Is that a hobby or is it a routine? Hmm? It is a routine because you are saying that every Thursday you play basketball. Okay. Can that be a hobby too? Uh, yes, because mm -hmm. uh, you can play it professionally or just for fun. Yes, yeah, for fun. Yeah. Most of the time we play for fun, right? For example, some some people play soccer just for fun, just because they want to enjoy time, right? Or spend some time with friends or with family. Okay, now we also use the simple to talk about actions that are scheduled. For example, if I have a schedule, like I will say mm, the train leaves, the train leaves at nine. The class starts at eight o'clock, right? That is something that is scheduled. You already know, and it will always happen at the same time. So the class starts at eight. The class finishes at 10, the plane leaves at six o'clock, right? So when we have something that is scheduled, we use the present simple. Even sometimes we may be talking about the, pre the future, Sammy. For example, here, when you say the plane leaves at nine, you can be talking about the present, but you can also be talking about the future because that means that it will live, but you don't say the plane will live at nine. You say the plane lives at nine. So you can be talking about future. The, the class finishes. What will happen to the class? It will finish at 10, right? But as it is scheduled, you can say the class finishes at 10. Yeah? So is there any question about when we use 
the present continues to talk about actions that are scheduled? No, no question. What is a schedule? Programado. Uh -huh, something that is programmed, right? You have a time. You have a time to do it, right? You have a day, you have a time, and you know that will it will happen exactly at that time. Now, let's go to the next. What are the adverse of frequency that we use when we're talking about the present? Mm -hmm. What are the adverse of frequency? Check, always, often, usually, sometimes, rarely, never. Remember a clue. If you see any of these words, your sentence cannot be in present continuous. It has to be in present simple, right? If you see the adverse of frequency, or the expressions of time can be adverse of frequency or expressions of time. And that means you're talking about what? Mm -hmm. You're talking about the present. You can be talking about a routine, a hobby, a habit, okay? But then you will use the adverse of frequency or expressions of time. So you say, I never go to the cinema alone. My grandmother sees her doctor twice a month. When does my, my grandmother see her doctor? Hmm? She sees her doctor twice a month. Okay. We use the, in this case, we have the present continuous and check. Today, we are going to be using the present continuous, but to talk about questions, right? So you're going to be making questions. Some can be yes, no questions, and others can be double H questions, right? That's what we are going to be studying later. Check. When we ask a question using the present continuous, we have to put the verb to be at the beginning, right? Are you eating? Mm -mm, I'm not eating. Is she singing? No, she's not singing. Are they reading? Mm, no, they are not reading, okay? So I put the verb to be at the beginning, then I have a subject, and after that, the verb in the ing form. That's questions with the present continuous. Yes, yeah. Any question over there? Mm -hmm. No questions. No? No question. Now, when do we use the present continuous? Let's see. Remember, we're still making a review of last class. When do we use the present continuous? For actions? At the moment. Mm -hmm. Exactly. For actions happening at the moment of speaking, right? So you say, it is raining outside. He can pick up the phone. He's taking a shower, right? The phone is ringing. Ring, 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 ring. But he can't pick up the phone because he's taking a shower. We also use it to talk about temporary actions. We are looking for a new house at the moment. Temporary action. Will you be looking for a house tomorrow, next week, the rest of your life? Yeah, all right, probably not. But at the moment, you're looking for a house. So we use it to talk about temporary situations. What is something that you're doing at the moment? Hmm? What are you doing at the moment? 
Who can I am studying English. I'm studying English. I am studying English. Okay. I'm studying English mm -hmm. at the moment. What else are you doing? I have a dinner. You um, have a dinner? I'm uh, studying English. I'm studying English. Okay. Remember to put the verb to be and then the other verb in ing, right? So you say, I'm studying, uh, I'm eating dinner. Would you be eating dinner in an hour? No, right? You will have finished. Yeah. But at the mm -hmm. moment, right, as a temporary action, you're doing that. So you say, I'm, mm -hmm. I'm, I'm studying second level, temporary, because you won't be in second level all the time. There is a moment when you will finish and you will go to third level and fourth and fifth and sixth, right? And so on. So talking about temporary situation. Okay, just making something general. Remember, we use present simple to talk about general truth. Give me an example of a general truth. Mm -hmm. It's the turn. Give me an example of a general truth. I teach my, I teach class every day. Okay. Routine. Mm -hmm. Remember that general truth is something that doesn't change even if you want. We're talking about a fact, right? For example, if you say, well, the sun raises in the morning. Mm -hmm. Can I change that? No. No, I cannot change it. Water boils at 100 degrees. Can I change that? Can I make water boil before? I can. The sun sets in the afternoon. Hmm. Can I make the sun set in the morning instead of in the afternoon? I can, at least not in our country, right? In other countries, probably things will be different, but here, no, okay? There are some countries where they have, uh, a, in the winter, they have night, all the 24 hours are night and the sun doesn't appear. But in El Salvador, we always have sun. We have a sun every day, even when it's going to rain, right? Okay, tell me about routine, give me a routine. What about a routine? Who wants to an example of a routine? Um, <clears throat> I go to the work and write a, a report. Okay, they work to work and write a report. Okay. Mm -hmm. Another example? Mm -hmm. Of a routine. If you say, uh, I work to the to my house. I go home. I go home mm -hmm. every day. Or, or, or what time do you go like home? It is like a, um, after the work, I work to my home. I go home after work. Okay, mm -hmm. very good. I go home after work. What about um, permanent situation? Mm. Another. What's a permanent situation? Um, okay. Did you see? Did you see a? Uh, um, Um, all day, uh, uh, um, uh, people. I see people every day. Every day, mm -hmm. remember, every day is todos los días, y all day mm -hmm. is todo el día. Mm -hmm. Every day. Mm -hmm. Okay, I see people every day. Okay. Mm -hmm. It's a permanent, permanent situation. Permanent. Exactly. <laughs> That's true. That's a permanent situation. Mm -hmm. 
Uh-huh. What about a timeline? Who can give me an example of a timeline? Damn it. <laughs> so <laughs> I don't the class remember. Starts, the class starts at. Ah, okay. The classes start uh, at eight o'clock mm -hmm. and finish at 10 o'clock. Okay. So if something is calendarized, right, then you mm. say mm, it is a timetable. But the schedule, it's, it means it has an hour that I cannot change. It will mm -hmm. always be at the same time, so I cannot change it, right? Then that's a mm -hmm. time. And another example, if um, I open my work or my, uh, so my workplace at 7.30 and close at 6.30. Okay. It, it's true. And I think it's a good, <laughs> a good example. <laughs> yeah, because it's, it's true for you. Okay. Yeah. So, mm -hmm. It, it closes, it closes, or it opens and it closes, right? Yes. Okay. okay. You have a time that you cannot change. It is time, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. right? It is scheduled. Exactly. Very good. Now, what is happening now? Remember, we use the present continuous to talk about what's happening now. What is happening now? Mm hmm What is happening now? Um, everybody is silent. Oh, everybody is listening. You're listening yeah. only. <laughs> oh, like see, yeah. Okay, I just, I just, then, I just leave it. Then, yes, no. Then, yeah. 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 Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> muy suave. Me descubrió mi fragante. Es que estaba revisando un mensaje del trabajo y, y me distraje. Recuerde, de aquí lo guacho, lo guacho. <laughs> What is happening now, Judy? Um, it's, um, it's, um, happy, it's, um, como que se dice, Brindis. Mm -hmm. Birthday. Um, A birthday party. Oh, where, 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 where is there a birthday party? Uh -huh. Where? ¿A dónde? ¿A dónde um, está la birthday party? In house. In your house. Right yes. now. But it's not your birthday party. Your birthday. Um, and I am um, like a club. Your? O'clock. No, but you're telling me that right now they are having a birthday party in your house. Is it your party? Is it your, sí. birth, your birthday party? ¿Es su cumpleaños o es el de alguien más? El de mi hijo. Ah, ah. Uh -huh. Oh, ok. Tell him happy birthday. Happy birthday <laughs> to you. Right, we start singing. Okay, great. Let's see here, another quiet person, Aristides. What's happening now in your house? Well, now my, uh, my mother is watching soap opera. Mm. And my okay. sister, which, which one I don't know, which one I don't know because I don't care 
Uh, about, about it. <laughs> I don't like. I don't like the bobera. You don't like the bobera. I don't. So I, I. I don't. It. It. It really. It doesn't matter for me. But my sister and my dad are sleeping right now. Mm, very early. And my neighbors, well, they are watching something because uh, I, and I listen to the TV. Exactly. Okay. Mm, and I am watching the computer screen. <laughs> okay. Okay. Great. Great, great experience. Okay, tell, remember that we use also, you are, we also use the present continuous to talk about changing situations, changing or developing situations. Who can give me an example of that? Mm -hmm. What's a changing situation? Yeah. Or a developing situation. For example, if you say, I'm learning English right now. Right now, probably in the future, you will be learning French, right? Mm -hmm. I'm taking English classes. Who knows? Next, next year, you will be taking computing classes, right? Uh-huh. Can I say one? Sure. Um, I I am having an exam tomorrow. You're having an exam tomorrow, or you are giving an exam to the poor students? <laughs> yes. Well, yeah, I, I give it. You're giving an, an exam to them. Okay. I am giving an exam to them, okay. but on, Tuesday 19, I am having an exam. Okay, that's the one that teacher is giving to you. Exactly. Okay. Uh, well, pagamos <laughs> well. <laughs> Okay. What about a temporary situation? What's a temporary situation? Who can give me an example? Um, <clears throat> I study English uh, right now, and um, mm -hmm. probably tomorrow. No. Because it's my day off. Because it's my day off. That's I have, why. I have a busy. <laughs> that's and why I you have to study. <laughs> That's why you have to study more because it's your day off. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> really, really. Days <laughs> okay. Days so far to study. Yes. Yes. Okay. But, mm -hmm. but I, I have a, a vaccine. A vaccination. Yes. Vaccination. Oh, for you. And now, <laughs> I think, I think, uh, probably, uh, I think. <laughs> so suffering tomorrow. Yes. Take a uh, cetaminophen. Yes. Yes. Before. <laughs> after, before and after. Before and after, yes. <laughs> and drink a lot of liquids, right? A yes. Lot. Yes. Yes. Okay, yeah. check. Thank you. <laughs> Suero, Gatorade, water, lemon. Water, lemon. <laughs> another. <laughs> and another liquid. A lot. Of yes. Buy a check. What about Just fixed, water. fixed future plans? Give me an example of fixed future plans. Uh, can I say? Sure. I prepare the exam for my students. I'm preparing. 
I preparing. I preparing exam for my students. When? Tomorrow? The, no, the next week. Okay. But no, the final exam, so yes. No, for the prom, the seniors. Ah, really? The seniors. Wow. Finish the other week. Finish next week. Yes. That's not the fair. next week. <laughs> <That's> not... <laughs> okay. uh, so for me, yes. <laughs> oh, I rest so... uh, uh, one week. <laughs> <laughs> so you say, I'm, I'm, I'm working on exams next week. But check this. Okay, this. I'm think. working from exam. Mm -hmm. But check this. Are you working in the exams next week or are you passing the exams next week? Because those are two different things. Okay. I, I pass the exam. You're next passing week. the exam next week. I pass it. Yes. So when are you working on the exam? In this week. Okay. I'm working mm -hmm. in the exam. Um, or you in can say week. I'm making the exams, right? Okay. Exams this week. Mm -hmm. Okay. Ah, period number four goes on flying, flying, flying. Okay. No questions here. No questions? No All questions. Right. Very nice. Pache. Now we have here some words. Remember the double H words? Uh, do you remember? A ver, what, when do we use what? When do we use what? Yes, when, when? What, what, what? When we wanna ask about, uh, we wanna ask for information about something. Mm -hmm. If we want to ask for information about something, we use what? Give me an example. Um, what time is it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh huh. What else? Mm. Good question. What are you doing? What are you doing? I was thinking about that one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, why not? What are you doing? Well, well I'm cooking, right? Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> also, we use it to, to ask for repetition. What did you say? What did you say? Uh -huh. What did you say? Mm -hmm. So if we want to ask for repetition, we use what? Also, we can use what for? And what for is similar to asking with why. Remember, we use why when we want to talk about reason, right? And the same happens here. <clears throat> so you say, what for? Mama, I need a computer. What for? Why do you need a computer? Why? Yes, I won't go to class. Why? Right? I want to travel. What for? Okay? So you can ask for a reason. Para qué? Right? That would be mm. other words. Para qué? Quiero ir a... Quiero salir. Para qué? Right? What for? And the parent says, no more. <laughs> no way. No way. Um, no way. No way. So that's what they will say. No way. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> okay, check. Then we have when. Remember when we use when to talk about? Yes, time. Time. We use when to talk about time. What about where? Where? When do you oh. use when? <laughs> when uh, when we want to know about a place or exactly or position. position okay location too 
right? So if I tell you, where are you coming from? I'm coming from home. I'm coming from work, right? I'm asking about a place. Where are you working? Remember, we're talking about present continuous right now, right? Where are you working? Where are you staying? Where are you staying on your vacation? Hmm? Where are you staying? Which, when do we use which? To talk about? Choice. If I have a choice, I use which. Which, which activity are you doing right now? Mm -hmm. Ah, we are doing a activity one. Which activity are you doing later? Later, we're doing activity two, right? Okay, who? Mm -hmm. Remember, we use who, what or which to talk about person, people, or subjects, right? For example, if I use who, because I'm talking about a person, if I use what, remember I'm using for information, I'm using for things. And if I use which, I'm talking about things too. Yes. Which, which school do you go to? Which company do you work at? Who are you talking to? Yes. What are you eating? So we use it to talk about things, things also, right, or subjects, and we use who to talk about people. Look at this. We're going to make a couple of questions here. Check. We will make questions. Remember, we were talking about double H words, right, but we are also talking about the present continuous. So we're going to make questions with the present continuous and double H words. Remember at the beginning, we were checking how we make just no questions, right? But now we are going to make information questions. So if you say, why am I eating chocolate? Okay. If you say, but I never eat chocolate, why am I eating chocolate? Hmm, maybe because you like it or because you need energy, right? Reason. What are you doing? What? What are you doing now? What are you doing right now? What are you doing right now? Huh? What are you doing right now? I'm studying. I'm studying. Okay. I'm studying when... English. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. when is Ricardo working? When is Ricardo working? Tomorrow and right now. He's working right now. <laughs> yes. Ricardo, too much work. Okay. <laughs> okay. What is Teresa doing? What is Teresa doing? She is listening to you. Teresa, are you listening to me? <laughs> she's, she's smiling. She's smiling. I'm watching at her. Teresa, yes. what are you doing, Teresa? <laughs> she's she's learning. She's scared. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? ¿Qué significa tu interés? Doing es siendo. ¿Qué estoy haciendo? Algo así, ¿verdad? Ajá, ya vi que no. <laughs> translator para eso. Sí, pero fíjense que estoy acá, pero si se fija, estoy haciendo lo de las, es que me gusta escribirlo acá en la computadora, lo que usted va diciendo. 
<risa> ¿Verdad? Pero sí, hay cosas que él entiende y hay cosas que no. Que estoy haciendo ahorita, pues, um, I am in class, English. Um, ¿Cómo se dice? Tratando de entender. Trying to understand. Trying to understand. Pero ya saben, si no entienden, pregunten. ¿Sí? Ok. Pregunten, pregunten. Ok. Thank you. Who are we meeting? Who are we meeting? Aquí, recuerden que meet no solo es encontrar, también es conocer. Right? Who are we meeting? Hmm? Uh, uh, mira, uh, I mira, uh, 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 Ricardo. I'm uh, meeting. I'm meeting uh, 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 Oscar. Mm -hmm. Thank you. We're meeting a lot of people, right? We're yes. meeting a lot of people in class. Uh -huh. How, are, how is Ricardo traveling? How? ¿Se acuerdan cuando preguntamos how? How is Ricardo traveling? They driving? Uh, he driving? Probably. Traveling? But how is he traveling? He's traveling by? Driving by his car. By car. By car. By car. Exactly. He's traveling by car. Okay. Mm -hmm. How are they traveling? They are traveling by bus. Okay, vamos a escribir las answers hoy. A ver. <clears throat> Tell me. Va, le vamos a cambiar aquí. Le vamos a poner. Why are you eating? ¿Qué están comiendo ustedes? Mm? Nothing. Nothing. Yes. Nothing. Ah, It's tomando. like a tartarita. <laughs> si no le vamos a pedir. <laughs> Ajá. Why are you eating chocolate? Why are you eating platanito frito? I'm eating candy. candy. Why are you eating candy? A ver, let's check. Yes. Why are you eating candy? <laughs> Because need a, uh, I need a, uh, sugar a little portion. <laughs> I need energy. Right? Yes. Yeah. Only, only, only a little energy. <laughs> a little energy. Yes. Y Ricardo va a decir, because I don't want to fall asleep while driving. Yes. <laughs> Probably. What about this one? What are you studying now? I'm studying English. I'm learning right now. Why are you studying right now? Well, what are you studying right now? I am studying English. I am studying English. Yes. I am studying the present continuous questions, right? I'm studying questions in the present continuous. When is Ricardo working? A ver, en vez de he. When is Ricardo working? He working. ¿Cómo se dice? 24 7. <laughs> He's working 24-7. We think. Okay. He's working 24-7. What is Benia doing? Hmm? What is Benia doing? Benia está dormida. Check it. Um, <clears throat> she's 
Checking ya. Oke. 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 Give me a reason. Why is it raining? Because the because plants need because why is it raining? <laughs> because a uh, <our> station. <laughs> because we are in winter. Yes, we are in winter. Yeah. Ajá. Because we are in winter, y en winter, pues que llueve, ¿verdad? Who are you meeting after class? Ya nadie vaya muy noche para andar encontrando gente. Who are you meeting? <risa> Digo yo. Who are you meeting after no. class? Who are you It's meeting? It's the night job. <laughs> Who are you meeting after class? <laughs> Luis, Luis. Um, uh -huh. Who are you meeting after class? Uh, probably a uh, uh, police. Mm -hmm. <laughs> when you when you walk when you walk to to the park or or the town town. <laughs> you you know uh, uh, a lot of birds. <laughs> Where you walk? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know where he walks, right? <laughs> no, that is that is an uh, example oh, <laughs> only. Okay. Oh, yeah. only example. Yes, okay. example. only example because uh, <laughs> a, a police. Uh, <laughs> ah no or a lot of people okay. a lot of people <laughs> we're meeting a lot of people okay how are how are they traveling those people that you are meeting <laughs> how, are they, how are they traveling tell me uh, <laughs> they are traveling Remember, we are going to give a complete answer, right? They are traveling. <laughs> oh. by, bu okay. by bus. After 10, will they find a bus? By car? Mm. Mm? By car. In, in Santa Tecla? Yes. The, <laughs> the 101 de? Mm -hmm. uh, this bus... Uh, Uh, at 11, 11, 11. Really? Yes. The last bus. The last bus gets to Santa Tecla at 11 p.m. Wow. 11, 11 p.m. It's a good service. Ah, good. <laughs> This bus is go the, the San Jose and Buenavista and Montesión here in Santa Tecla. Wow, bueno, es que Santa Tecla es very big, right? Ah, you see, vaya, yes. if you walk after class in Santa Tecla, you will meet a lot of people. Yes, right. <laughs> a very... <laughs> On the 101 de. <laughs> y todavía corre la 101 de hasta esa hora. Yes, teacher, yes. It's a normal for road. emergency. I, I, oh, I arrived there, man. the bus. For emergency? I arrived the bus. You have taken the bus. Yes, I taken, taken the, bus the bus. At that time. Yes. Mm -hmm. Wow. But imagine that 11 in the street también, ¿verdad? Yes. Yo creo que It's fear. Después de, de todo esto de estar guardadito aquí como que yo he perdido la rutina, la costumbre de andar fuera de noche. Ya había perdido la costumbre de andar fuera cualquier hora del día, pero hoy martes noche. 
Ya, total, total. Vaya, let's see. Y fíjese que, y fíjese que es mejor salir de noche porque sí, sí encuentran muchas personas, pero son así en distintos lugares y en distintas distancias. Ajá, that's true. Less people, uh -huh. right? Less people. Vaya, let's make questions here. Tell me. Mm. A ver, a ver. How can you make that question? Or those questions? Um, These are just no questions. All. See? These are just no questions. Can you help me make questions here? And with WH question. Mm -hmm. No, these are just no questions. Yes, sir. Is Lisa swimming in the lake? Is Lisa swimming? Swimming? In the lake. Yo y Mimi. Is Lisa swimming? Swimming. ¿Qué dice? Is Lisa swimming in the lake? ¿Qué otra pregunta podríamos hacer? Yo quiero hacer una yes no question. Una information question. Why? Why, why? Is Lisa, why is Lisa swimming in the lake right now? Why? Why is Lisa swimming in the lake right now? Por qué? Tan hard. Right? Mm -hmm. What about number two? Uh, WH question. Or yes or no? Any question we can do. Pero en, en continuous, present continuous, right? Make a question. Mm -hmm. Can we make a yes no question? Are you helping? Are you helping your brother? Hmm? Are you helping your brother? Yes. Yes, we are. What about number three? Is he? Visiting when? the museum. When? Okay, bye, pues. When? when? Is he what? Visiting. Visiting. Quitemosle a y pongamosle de entonces, right? When is he visiting the museum? Hmm. He's visiting the museum on the weekend. What about this one? When is Doris washing her t-shirt? Podemos preguntar where, right? Where is Doris washing? Where is Doris washing her t-shirt? Ah, yeah, in the bathroom. Right? She is washing her t-shirt in the bathroom. What about number four? Why? Why they? Why are? Why are they running? Why are they running home? Why are they running home? Oh, mm -hmm. Because it's raining. Ya vieron que montón de why no salen. Porque de chiquito preguntamos why. Why? Why? Se acuerdan. Okay, what about number six? What? Mm. What is Henry listening to the radio? What is Henry? Henry? What is Henry listening to in the radio? ¿Qué está oyendo Henry en el radio? Right? 
What is Henry listening to in the radio? Ah, he's listening to the news. He's listening to the rancheras, right? He's listening to his favorite DJ. Okay, what about number seven? What? 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 What is breakfast? What are we making for breakfast? What are we making for breakfast? Okay. What are we making for breakfast? Hmm. We're making beans, cheese, fried eggs, right? Okay, number eight. When are Ron and Fred checking the computer? Checking mm -hmm. the Checking. Check when are Ron and Fred checking the computer? Next week, they are checking the computer next week. Okay, questions? Yes, I have. One. Okay, tell me. Uh, I have uh, I have an issue with the number six question. What is Henry listening to in the two the radio? I know him in the two. What happened? What happened there? <laughs> I start. Thank you, King Aristides. Right? Yeah. Okay. What is, yeah, and I said it well, but I didn't write it well. What is Henry listening to in the radio? See? What is Henry listening to in the radio? ¿Qué está oyendo Henry? En el radio. Ya no, ¿qué está oyendo? Nada más. ¿Qué está oyendo en el radio? Right? He's listening to the news. He's listening to the, 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 the soccer game. He's listening to music. So what is he listening to? Thanks. Thank you, Henry. Henry. <laughs> yeah, Henry. <laughs> Thank you, Aristides. Okay, any question? Any other question here? Hmm? No, no question. Okay. Question. Now. Call the attendance. Call the attendance. See if he has a I'm going to stop sharing. <laughs> yes, yes. A ver, Ángel. Ángel. Present. Present. Ar yeah. Aristides. Present. Denia. Denia. Present. Um, Edwin. No vino el mismo. Fátima. Present teacher. Isabel. Present. Luis Mauricio. Present teacher. María. Present teacher. Marisela. Present. Marlene. Present. Maura. Present. Miriam. 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 No está Miriam. Creo que no, teacher. Yo me he jurado que Miriam no está. No, no está. Ok, Oscar. Present teacher. Ricardo. Está fallando el inter a mi teacher. Ricardo. Present. Teresa. Present teacher. Walter. Walter. Yesenia. Yesenia. Judy. Okay, great. Well, 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 well. Now, 
we are going to go to some exercises. I'm sorry. I'm going to share. Here, you're going to make some questions, right? I'm going to share. Se lo voy a poner aquí, está aquí. En Zoom. Me parece. Yes, no. No, teacher. Yes, teacher. <laughs> pues así nos toca, ¿verdad? No, teacher. Yes, teacher. Yes. Bueno, no contesto, pues contestamos nosotros. Da, you will make questions. Oops. Oops, oops. Va, ahí van. Voy a usar, eh, los pueden ver, ¿verdad? En el chat de Zoom. Sí. ¿Sí? Yes. Va, perfecto. Ok, I'm going to share pero no igual como ya los mando para los grupos sí okay I'm going to send you one group of one group, group of four all the others are groups of three what you're going to do is to write the questions okay Write the questions. Ready? Yeah. No, answer, teacher, only questions. Only the questions. Only the okay. questions. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Remember to follow it. You have to use all the words given. They are not in disorder. Yeah. They are not in disorder. What you have to do is to include what you're missing to make the question. Allá vamos. Servimos a Mari. A Mari try to join. Try to join Mari. Isabel to. Good. Mani Mari, no sé. No sé dónde la acordé. Let's Hola. Doctora. Let's start. Sí. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Make a, a, a question with double H words. Yeah. yeah there are double H words. Double H. Okay. <clears throat> Uh, that is a uh, make a, make a question or order the, the make question. question. Make question. <laughs> make question. Make question. Okay. Mm -hmm. They are all present continuous, right? Questions in present continuous. You may you can make um, some. You have a couple of, of just no questions, but most of them are double H words, double mm -hmm. H questions. Okay, okay. Si me desaparezco porque está. But I do the Kuta cinema. Going. 
going sería, ¿verdad? Going. Mm -hmm. Sí. What time, What are, time are you going? Are you going to the cinema, verdad? Yes. Okay. What time? Sería yeah. número uno. What time you are you going? What time are you going to the cinema? Mm -hmm. Y ahora hay que responder eso. No, right now only make the questions. No, no, solamente okay. questions. Sí, okay. solo concentrense en las questions. Okay. La siguiente sería Who you study? Eh, why you why you studying study. sería verdad why you studying what, you, you what are you doing no what are you why you what are you studying studying pienso yo que verdad sí studying siguiente la tres Sería tú irás puede poner vamos a ver se puede utilizar yes no question which one number three yes three sí, that is That's you going it. shopping at the weekend. Are you? Are you? Are you going shopping at the weekend? Mm -hmm. Yes. Are you going shopping at the weekend? Great. Ahí no importa que vayan dos así con, con ING. Teacher. Are you going shopping? No, porque uh -huh. shopping no es verbo. Ah, ok. No, no problem. Porque su verbo okay. es going. Yeah. Are you going? going ajá. Sí. Are you going okay, shopping? Ok, la cuatro. Sería, when you are when are you? living. When are you living? Ajá, when are you living. Uh -huh. when are you living? Where are you living? I'm living in Las cinco sería. What what are you drinking now? Mm -hmm. What drinking now? Teacher, I have a question for you. Okay. okay. In this question, I have to make a sentence with you go shopping at the weekend. And so uh, I am doubting about this four. Are you going for shopping at the, at the weekend? No, you go shopping. You go shopping. Mm -hmm. Are you? You go shopping. You don't go for shopping. You go shopping. You go shopping for food. For food. So, but what are we going to do about uh, which verb we, we can use for ing for? Going. Going. But if I take this off, Are you going shopping? Yep. Just like that. Mm -hmm. uh, shopping. Es que oh. shopping, shopping no es verbo. Mm -hmm. uh -huh, uh -huh. Shopping no es verbo. Shopping es ir de compras. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Then you say, are you going shopping? Are you going for a walk? Are you going eh, que swimming? Uh -huh. Entonces el verbo allí es going. No okay. shopping. Okay, I was out in because going shopping, going shopping. So, sí. yeah. like, like you said, uh, are you going 
to no no not, not, never mind there <laughs> 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 mind. but aquí tenemos esta otra when are but, you leaving yeah. when are you leaving okay esta sería what are you le sale mejor así verdad pegado en zoom porque lo pueden copiar y, y escribir allí sí uh -huh. sí ese eh, es mejor así trabajar en pareja o en equipo que alguien esté digitando sí sí es, es mejor what are you doing now drinking no what are you drinking now mm -hmm. Right. Very cute. Maricela. Hola. Hello, teacher. Me les falta las preguntas que han hecho. Eh, en una, el, el, el voladito. Vamos a ver, suba desde la primera. Estas son las primeras. A ver. No. Estas son. Ajá. What, what time? ¿Qué are, le falta? Uh -huh. are, ah, what time are you going to the cinema? Yes. Why are you studying? Uh -huh. Studying? ¿Qué le falta studying? Eh. Studying? Eh, la D, la Y, ajá, uh -huh. Y, no, ¿Sí? Y, Y, Y de yo, yo, ah, ah, así, ah, exactly, why are you studying, uh -huh. what are you, why are you, aquí es donde teníamos duda, ajá, uh -huh. ¿cuál es tu verbo? Ah, ah, exacto. Es el que estábamos, o sea, por no esto, porque no. ¿Cuál es, ¿Cuál es su verbo? Go. Go. Exacto, el verbo es go. Going shopping at the weekend. Okay. Es que lo, lo veíamos y lo veíamos un poco raro y por eso mejor dijimos, dejémoslo así y cuando venga la teacher le preguntamos, ¿verdad? O sea que shopping aquí no está cumpliendo, sí es un verbo, pero no, no, no es la acción principal, digamos. Es como cuando usted dice go to work, que work no es verbo en ese momento. Ajá, Entonces, es una. ¿Qué pasa acá? Why are you going shopping? Ok. Going shopping es ir de compras. Uh -huh. y, y ahí, teacher, queda si no nada más, o se puede decir también, we are you going in the shopping at de weekend. Sí, ahí depende. Ustedes pueden hacer una yes, no question. Are you mm -hmm. shopping at the weekend? Are you shopping? Otra. Why are you going shopping at the weekend? Pueden mm -hmm. preguntar también, where are you going shopping at the weekend? Who are you well. going shopping with at the weekend? O sea, ahí pueden ser cualquier pregunta, ¿verdad? Right? Mm -hmm. yes. la, la única que nosotros poníamos que no podíamos poner en opción era when. Because uh, we have ah, a weekend. Ya dice a the weekend, exactly. Uh -huh. Si dice when, le tendría que quitar el weekend. El weekend. Okay, weekend. Exactly. exactly. Okay. Continue. And what about the other? <laughs> what are. Uy. Uh -huh. Permítanme un segundo que están tocando en la puerta de mi casa. Continue, please. <laughs> What about the other one, Denny? What? Uh, what are you drinking now? Uh -huh, that's why I showed you my little bottle, right? What <laughs> are you drinking now? Yes. Now. Mm -hmm. Very good. In back. Okay. Esta, como quedaría? What I... What are what what are you drinking 
Excepto la primera. Excepto la número uno. Ajá. Entonces. ¿Cómo van? When you, when you live, eh, más o menos. Can, can, somebody, can somebody share? Can somebody share the screen? Alguien va tomando nota eh, para el grupo y compartiendo. En el chat del grupo lo estamos compartiendo, teacher. Porque no, no podemos, bueno, no podemos compartir, yo no puedo compartir, creo. Sí, todos pueden. Todos pueden compartir pantalla. En serio, vamos a ver. Dele clic en compartir pantalla y escoge lo que quiere compartir. Ah, ok. Es que sí van viendo lo que van escribiendo. Estamos escribiendo. Uh -huh. mm, ya. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Ahí está. Perfect. What are you sharing? Isabel. Ah, Isabel is sharing. Yeah. Isabel is sharing. Ah, yeah. Solo una cosa. Tienen que copiar las oraciones y pegarlas en un Word porque Zoom no comparte Zoom. Uh -huh. Oye, Zoom no comparte Zoom. Entonces tienen que copiar las oraciones y pegarlas en un documento. Porque si no, no lo vale. We see. We finished, teacher. Excellent. Teacher, Tell me. Uh, uh, we're getting back to the group. No. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, the time is off. Yeah. Oh. I was just checking if you have finished. You're ready, oh. right? Yeah. We're totally ready. Perfect, perfect. Okay, I will call you then. Let's see. Okay, everybody coming. Let's see. Yeah, right. A ver, what about question number one? What time? What time? What time are you going to the cinema? Mm -hmm. Wait, where is my mouse? Okay, what time are you 
going to the cinema. Yes. What time are you going to the cinema? Number two. Why are you studying? Check that for study, you only add ing, right? Why are you studying? <clears throat> Number three. Are you, are you going, going shopping at the weekend? Mm -hmm. Are you going shopping at the weekend? I don't get the mouse. Are you going shopping at the weekend? What about number four? When are you leaving? When are you leaving? And remember, leaving, we omit the letter E. And then we add ing, right? When are you leaving? Mm -hmm. What about number five? What are you drinking now? Uh -huh. What are you drinking now? What about number six? What are you thinking? What are you thinking? Okay, number seven. Is she working okay. in the office at the moment? Uh huh. Is she working? In an office at the moment? Full mouse. You give the mouse. Is she working in an office at the moment? What about the next one? What time? Is she, is coming? she coming? What time is she coming? The same. We change the I, the E to, we eliminate the E, right? And then we add ING. Uh huh. What about the next one? Where? Where are you playing tennis tonight? Mm -hmm. Where are you playing tennis tonight? Uh -huh. What about number 10? They are in question. Are they studying Portuguese? Uh -huh. Are they studying Portuguese? Studying, right, ING? Are they studying? I write, uh, where? I, where, I, are I, they where? Studying where are they studying China? Portuguese? Where are they studying Portuguese? Yes. What about number 11? Where are you going now? Where are you going now? And the last one? What are you doing? Mm -hmm. What are you doing? Nice. No problems, no questions here? No questions. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's go to the manual then. So remember, we're talking about double H words, right? Why is he meeting the new people today? Huh? Because he has another meeting tomorrow. When is the new office launching? It is launching on November the 7th. Where is your boss having the annual meeting? In December. In December. Right? Okay. What you're going to do here 
in this page, go to your manual, page 36. Page 36. What company are you working for, right? What company are you working for? And what you're going to do now is complete the question for number two. How? How are, how is he dividing the growth? Uh -huh. How is he? We are going to do it or you are going to type it? You type it in your book. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Sí, porque no, no. You type it in your book and I type it here. Okay. okay. Pero les voy a dar un ratito para que lo hagan todo. And then we check. Teacher, what is the meaning of hand in this in this sentence? And the number the number three? Como entregar. Oh. Oh, okay. Entregar. Thank you. Ay, que me quedé leyéndolo porque este eh, ahí depende el context. Porque, por ejemplo, hand puede, puede también significar si usted le dice a alguien, can you give me a hand? Me puedes ayudar, right? Mm -hmm. No de que quiere que le dé la mano, right? Sino que, que, si, que si le, como cuando nosotros decimos en español, me echas una mano, right? So, can you give me a hand? Me puedes echar una mano, right? Ok, thank you. Pero en este caso es handing the checks, es como entregarlo, ¿cuándo va a entregar los cheques? Let me know when you're ready. A ver, let's see number two. How? How is he dividing the groups? Mm -hmm. How is he dividing the groups? Very clear. Thanks. What about number three? When? When is she handing the checks? The check. When is she handing the checks? Very good. What about number four? Which factory? Are your boss visiting this month? Singular or plural? Mm. Is. Mm -hmm. Which factory is your boss visiting this month? Mm -hmm. Why? Is the new secretary, is the new secretary working, working the next Saturday? Saturday? Why is the new secretary working? Why is the new secretary working next? Y siempre este de que no. No se acostumbren a ponerle de a las cosas que van con next. Oye, porque no es necesario. Ahí es como que se está pensando en Spanish. La semana próxima, el próximo sábado. In, in Spanish, yes. But in English, no. You say, why is the new secretary working next Saturday, not the next Saturday. 
Las expresiones que van con next no llevan de. Hoy. Eso acuérdense. Expresiones que van con next no llevan de. Eso no. no. Ok. Así es que no se, no se acostumbren ustedes a ponerle de. Vaya, antes de irnos a esta, vamos a subir a la página anterior. We have a conversation here. Let's read the conversation. Repeat after me. Please. Good afternoon. This is Rita, the new secretary. Luis, good afternoon. This good is afternoon. Rita, is the, new Rita. Secretary. the new secretary. I just want to confirm some information. I just want to confirm want to some confirm information. information. Hey, Rita, sure, tell me. Hey, Rita, sure, tell me. I want to know who are attending the new, the, the annual conference this year. I want to know I want to who are know attending who are the are attending annual, annual conference, conference this year. year. And where is it taking place? And where is it taking place? Well, the IT staff well, is attending. Well, the IT staff is attending. And the conference is taking place in the great room. And the conference is taking place in the great room. Rita, by the way, when are the materials arriving? Rita, by the way, when are the materials arriving? Do you know? Do you know? Now. Got it. Yes, they are arriving on Friday morning. Got it. Yes, yes. they are arriving, they are arriving on Friday, Friday morning. morning. Okay, one more time. Luis, you say Luis like in a question, right? Luis, good afternoon. Como cuando usted levanta el teléfono, dice María. Good afternoon. This is Rita, right? Pedro, como quien dice, eh, ¿quién es el que me está contestando? Right? Es Luis, es Pedro, es María. Entonces, por eso que va con, con, con este signo de pregunta acá. Ok. Entonces, Luis, para que Luis le diga, sí, yo soy Luis, right? Luis, good afternoon. This is Rita. Uh -huh. Luis. 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 Good afternoon. Good afternoon. This is Rita. The new secretary. I just want to confirm some information. I just want to confirm some information. Hey, Rita. Sure. Tell me. Hey, Rita. Sure. Tell me. I want to know who I want to know who are attending the annual conference this year. I want I to want know to who know are attending what? the annual conference this year. And where is it taking place? And where, where is, is it taking place? place? Well, the IT staff is attending. Well, the IT staff is attending. And the conference is taking place in the great room. And the conference and the is taking place in the great room. Rita, by the way, when Rita, Rita, by the way, by the way, by the way. So esta expresión la usamos cuando, como quien dice, eh, hey, aprovechando, right? Pero va usted a cambiar la conversación o cambia el tema, right? Como hablando de una cosa por otra, right? That, that, that we do that change all the time. When are the materials arriving? Do you know? When are the materials arriving? When Do you know? Arriving. Do you know? Got it. Yes, they are arriving on Friday morning. Yes. Got it. Yes, they are arriving they are on, Friday on Friday morning. Okay, checking. Aquí probablemente les, les suene así como que raras las respuestas porque ella está respondiendo a lo anterior y después a la otra pregunta, right? Como cuando nosotros estamos en una conversación normal. 
¿verdad? Y que sin darnos cuenta respondemos a varias preguntas al mismo tiempo. Entonces, es la situación. A ver, vamos a las questions. Use the conversation above to help yourself. Complete the questions. When? You are surviving. When? 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 That's easy, right? When are the materials? Yes. When are the materials arriving? What about number two? Who? Who? Who is attending the conference? What about number three? Where? Where? Now tell me, when are the materials arriving? When are the materials arriving? Who can tell me the answer? Uh, when, 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 when. when are the they materials are arriving on Friday morning? On Friday morning. Mm -hmm. Who is attending the conference? The IT staff. Where is the meeting taking place? In the great room. In the great room. See? Okay. It's in the great room. Right? Okay. Now, let's go to page 36 again. You're going to think about five future events of your classmates. ¿Se acuerdan? La semana pasada escribieron sobre five future events in your company. ¿Se acuerdan? Sí, ¿verdad? A ver, no dice Aristides. Qué barbaridad, Aristides. Ok, now what you're going to do is to write questions about your partners. Check. Think of some future events of your classmates. Ya sus compañeros la semana pasada le dijeron qué future events tienen en su compañía, right? Now, write five questions to ask your classmates about those events. Uh -huh. Ya viene Christmas. Pueden ustedes pensar en Christmas. Conoce si ustedes celebran Halloween o que tienen algo para Thanksgiving o para el Black Friday en sus compañías, right? Ahí tienen varios eventos que pueden como tomar un poquito en cuenta. A ver. Ok, bye, in my bye. company. Huh? What did you say, Luis? Uh, in my company, it's, it's the anniversary. The anniversary, okay. Then what you're going to do is great questions to ask your classmates about those events. Okay. Ya allí Luis ya les tiró un aire que para él es su anniversary. Entonces, yo los voy a mandar a los rooms, ¿verdad? Recuerden, page 36. Los voy a mandar a los rooms para que si alguno dice, ay, mi compañía, nosotros vamos a celebrar el aniversario. Ok, ¿qué actividades? ¿Qué actividades puede mencionar relacionado con el aniversario? ¿Qué le pueden preguntar a Luis? ¿Sí? Well, uh, what is the promotion? <laughs> promotion. <laughs> mm -hmm. For the anniversary. Are, they, are you having any promotions? Porque acuérdense yeah. que estamos hablando de present continuous y seguiremos usando present continuous. Entonces, lo voy a dejar así un poco abierto como si quieren usar yes no questions o si quieren usar information questions. ¿Sí? Entonces, uh -huh. en el grupo le pregunta a su compañero, ¿qué evento tienen? A ver, su compañero menciona un evento y ustedes escriben cinco preguntas relacionadas, ok, de cosas que ustedes le pueden preguntar a su compañero sobre ese evento que tiene, ok. Vamos a ver qué tenemos. Diez minutos. Ok. Ready. Ready. Vaya, pues. Vamos a volverlos a crear. Uy, que me queda un grupo de dos. 
Es que se me han perdido un par. Ya. Vale, allá vamos, chicos. There you go. Join the rooms. Oh, room number four, no me entra ni una, ni una, ni una. Maura, Mari, 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 Maura. Maura, hello. Se congeló. Cuando, eh, when you, creo, when, when are you having white casting, creo. Sí. Esa, what are you doing for Black Friday? What are you doing for Black Friday? Good. Uh, are you celebrating? Como, como que? What are you celebrating? Mm -hmm. Or are you celebrating Thanksgiving? Are you inviting people to your celebration? Yeah, come with discount. Are you having discounts? Are you having discounts or a special? Yeah, special discount. Yes. Special. Uh, but, uh -huh. Yeah. Uh, Te gusta. Sería what como event does you do in the future? Perdón, Marlene. Sería como ella dijo degustación, degustación para un fin de semana. Sí, exacto. En Sería de promoción de producto, ¿verdad? Degustación. Ah, degustación. Ajá, de un producto de product new. Ok, pero ahí está, lo está promocionando, ¿verdad? De un producto nuevo. Exacto por medio de la degustación. Entonces, para mí es promoción de producto nuevo. Sería promoción de liquors new. New production promotion eh, de, li, de liquors. De degustación. You can say, are you giving any tasting? ¿Cómo se dice degustación? Tasting. 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 Entonces, ¿cómo podríamos poner eh, que ella va a promocionar el producto? Bueno, este es samples. Fíjese, samples, porque, por ejemplo, cuando, cuando se trata de, de un producto, que se está promocionando, que dan trocitos chiquitos o en este caso si el liquor um, a veces dan botellitas chiquitas o copitas para probarlo entonces esos son samples ejemplo verdad de las degustaciones ajá samples se podría se podría Aquí poner samples yuri yuri o chi chi no, es que son preguntas Teresa 
Ah, ok. Uh -huh. Yo pensé que iba a ser. O sea, Ajá, pero primero las preguntas a un lado y al otro lado la respuesta. Are you giving any samples? Entonces dice. Sería. Ajá. En la pregunta, ¿verdad? Are you giving ¿Qué? any samples? ¿Qué evento, en mi caso, como él me estaba preguntando, ¿qué evento tiene Yuri el fin de semana? Ajá. ¿Qué evento will it have in the future? Le había puesto yo. What event is Yuri having? Ajá. Uh -huh. Is Yuri having in the future? What event is Yuri having in the future? What, it, what event? What event? Yuri. What event is Yuri having in the future? Hoy tenemos castigado a los clientes, teacher. Yes. Con eso de que no podemos darle degustación es ya cierto. de instante. Sí, y lo que, lo que se está haciendo es que se le da una muestra. Es una, es una bolsita pequeña, pero con... Con el, o sea, así como esta bolsita de donde se meten como los sándwiches que vienen selladas. Ajá. Ajá. Ajá, algo así se dan ahora las muestras. Para que el cliente se lo pueda llevar a casa. Que lo vaya a tomar a su casa. Ay, sí. Yes. Sí, pues sí, ni modo, y todo cambia. Entonces solo vamos haciendo las preguntas y las vamos contestando de una sola vez. Yes. Ok. Entonces sería prom promoción. Promotions. Are you having, are you having any promotions? Ajá, acuérdense que todo va a ir en ING, ¿verdad? Entonces, are you having any promotions? Is Yuri having any promotions? Is Teresa having a graduation? Mm -hmm. Marlene, que nos comparte. Hello. Where sería como donde donde celebras donde celebramos where are you celebrating? Remember uh -huh. it's no present, uh -huh. it's present continuous, right? Yes, yes. Where are you celebrating? Or where, where is Ricardo you? celebrating? Where is Angel celebrating? Because remember you're asking about a partner from from the group. Mm. Okay, okay. Oh. Where is Ricardo Not celebrating? Just a for a for a work uh -huh. a, okay future events at work uh -huh. I, I don't see another another part <laughs> ahí está angel ricardo he's Mauro. right coming yes <laughs> Maura. he's right coming maura ahí está maura está dormida pero no <laughs> <laughs> I don't see it. I don't see. Okay, Maura. You have a, a some someone event. Repeat. <laughs> you have a, any event? In your in your workplace or your family, um, your personal your life, people, personal. Hey, um, with your boyfriend <laughs> or husband, I think so. Uh, <laughs> with the police, <laughs> I celebrate classes. When are you finishing classes? A teacher, take a look. 
Uh, these two are from Isabel. This... I cannot see. Anna Sharon. Move the page, como no, pero estamos viendo los mismos de, 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 de la vez pasada. Really? Go up. No, this? No. I'm going to read what I see. How is he oh. dividing the groups? Uh, 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 uh. Voy a volver a compartir la pantalla. Okay. Ahora. Oh, sí, sí. What are you doing for Black Friday? Are you having discounts? Yes. Are you inaugurating community projects this month? When are you inaugurating the first community project? When is taking place the first community? Ay, ahí sale un museo cambio. When is the first community project inauguration taking place? Taking place, okay. Al final. Mm -hmm. Taking, bueno, más fácil así. When is, ahí está. Ajá. Así. Sí. Porque es que todo su sujeto es the first community project inauguration. inauguration. Take so this is the subject. Mm -hmm. Okay. Are you finishing classes this month? No, verdad. No sé. Yes. Yes. October. Really? Wow. Yeah. When are you finishing classes? Okay. It's okay. What are you doing after you finish classes? Mm, I'm going to keep studying English mm -hmm. <laughs> and I, I'm gonna relax okay. and celebrate my birthday. Oh, yeah, because it's in the super, right? <laughs> exactly. Mm -hmm. Great, great, great. Well, I'm going to call you then because we are two minutes to finish. Two minutes, two minutes. Good. Good job. We're going back. Okay. It's hey, Maura, very fast, Maura. Good. Es que se me sale. Tengo problemas con el internet porque me sale de las sesiones. No, sí que ya los llamé. Ah. Okay, bueno, ahí vamos. Let's see, let's see. Any questions? Mm -hmm. Any questions? Questions, questions? What even does Judy have in the future? Uh -huh. future? What event is Judy having in the future? Yeah. Uh, La respuesta, are you having a promotion example testing? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Y de Marlene, what even does Marlene have in the future? Y la respuesta, is Marlene having supply of product for the Christmas season? Christmas, yes, Christmas is coming. Mm -hmm. Nice. No sé si está bueno. Piense que están bien. Lo único que hay una en donde me ocupó el present simple. En, en what have even does Marlene have? Ajá. Ajá. Entonces ahí para ponerla en, en present continuous podemos poner what event is Marlene having? Having. What event is Marlene having? Is Marlene having? Uh -huh. Porque estamos uh -huh. hablando de, de future, ¿verdad? De un future así bien cerquita. What event is Okay. Ah, uh -huh. porque la respuesta es exactly in the future. Uh -huh. Okay. What event is Marlene having in the future? Very good. Okay. Very good. Very great. Vamos a llamar la attendance, ¿verdad? 
El tiempo vuela, chicos. Vuela, vuela. Vamos a ver. Let's see. Um, tell me present. Ángel. Present. Aristides. Present. Denia. Present. Eh, Tuarto. Edwin. Fátima. Present teacher. Isabel. Present teacher. Luis. Present teacher. María Fernanda. María Fermelinda. María. Maricela. Ahí andaba Maricela. Marlene. Present. Maura. Present. Miriam. Oscar. Oscar. Ricardo. Present teacher. Teresa. Walter. Y Yesenia. Yesenia. Aquí. Allá. Yo te sé. ¿Quién es yo te sé? Ay, Yuri. Ay, Yuri. Yuri, present. Present, chef. <laughs> so sorry, Yuri. So sorry. Ok, very good. Bueno, ya estamos. Estamos, estamos. A ver. ¿Quién se queda conmigo hoy? Vamos a ver, hoy es cuatro, Nidia. <coughs> Nidia Marilyn. It's no here. It's no here, Nidia. I have a volunteer. Bueno, pasen un bonito, una bonita noche. See you And tomorrow. You the Wednesday. Thank you. <laughs> Do I have a volunteer? Es más fácil que esté mañana que el miércoles. Fíjense, lo van a vacunar mañana. Yes, yes. <laughs> For me da risa porque alguien no sabe el experience. <laughs> Now, <Good night>. Ted. <laughs> Please, God. Please, God, you don't have pain. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> Good night. Good night, everybody. Good night. Good night. Good night. Will I have a volunteer victim? Volunteer. <ríe> me miran así como que no quiero ajá ay María 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 hello ay Mari hello 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 María 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 hello Hi, Maria. Will you stay with me? Maria, hello. Mari. Maria, Maria, hello. Hi, Maria. Are you still there? Do you have any questions? Maria, 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 hello. Hi, hi.
Hello, Maria. All right, you're not here. Hi, hi. Do you have any questions? Hi, hi. Maria, hello. Can you hear me? Mm -hmm. Hi, hi. Hello. Maria, Maria. Hello, Maria. Hello. Hi, hi. Okay. Well, we're going to make some questions here questions about future events, right? Are you having a Christmas celebration? Celebration. A word, ah, celebration, celebration at work. This year, mm -hmm. because last year we didn't have one, right? Are you having, are you having a Christmas celebration at work this year? You can say yes, or you can say no, right? What are you doing? For Black Friday, for Thanksgiving, for Thanksgiving Day. What are you doing for Thanksgiving Day? Are you invite? Okay, here if you see we're combining a just no question with information question, right? Are you inviting? Or if your company, because we're talking about the company, right? Is, is your company inviting all the companies? The anniversary. Anniversary. Mm -hmm. Is your company inviting other companies to the anniversary? And then you say yes or no. If your answer is yes. Okay. Okay, what special food 
So, are you preparing me? Yeah. What special food are you preparing? What are you? Hmm. What special activities are you doing? What special activities are you doing? And you can, of course, you can make many other questions, right? Like they can be <laughs> almost all the questions I use in what? Okay, where? We can say, where are you doing the company's anniversary? So we can change a little bit and have other questions, not only questions with what. Where are you having the company's anniversary? Good, good, good. These are just a couple of questions, right? That you can see or that you can do. Hmm. You can you can ask here. Is your company inviting other companies to the anniversary, or who is your company inviting to the anniversary? Yeah, so we can change it a little bit, and we can use another double H word, right? That's what we were talking about yesterday. What are you doing? We can say here, what are you doing? Or what are you having for a Christmas celebration? Mm -hmm. So we can change the question. What are you having for Christmas? Christmas. Mm -hmm. What are you having for Christmas celebration? That can include like the food, the drinks, the party, whatever. Right? What are you having for Christmas celebration? Okay. Different things that you can be doing. Okay. Well, that's it for today. Let's see. Bye bye, Maria.